Traces of bird flu have been detected in pasteurized milk, leaving many people wondering if it's safe to drink. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration FDA, released a notice on Thursday stating that one in five retail samples of commercial milk tested positive for fragments of highly pathogenic avian influenza HBAI, more commonly known as bird flu or avian flu. The share of milk with viral remnants was higher in areas where herds of cattle had been infected. The presence of the virus in the milk doesn't necessarily mean there is a risk to consumers, however, the FDA noted. Additional testing is required to determine whether an intact pathogen is still present and if it remains infectious, which would help inform a determination of whether there is any risk of illness associated with consuming the product, the agency stated. Dr. Scott Pegan, professor of biomedical sciences at the University of California, Riverside, reassured consumers that pasteurized milk is safe and there is no current reason to avoid it based on the FDA's findings. Dr. Edward Liu, chief of infectious diseases at Hackensack Meridian Jersey Shore University Medical Center, emphasized that pasteurization is key in killing off viruses and ensuring the safety of milk products. The FDA reiterated its recommendation to avoid drinking raw milk that has not been pasteurized and urged producers to take precautions when discarding milk from affected cows to prevent further spread of the virus. The CDC states that the risk to the general public remains low, and both the FDA and USDA confirm that the commercial milk supply is safe. The incident has raised concerns about the potential spread of bird flu to humans and highlights the importance of following safety guidelines in food production and consumption.